Hello guys. Smoking releases thousands of chemicals into your body. The result isn't only damage to your lungs, but also your heart and many other body structures. But even if you've smoked for many years, you can reverse these effects and experience health benefits from the first hours you stop smoking. In this video you will see what happens to your body if you quit smoking, and some recommendations how to do it better. So let's get started. 20 Minutes In as little as 20 minutes after the last cigarette is smoked, the heart rate drops and returns to normal. Blood pressure begins to drop, and circulation may start to improve. In addition, fibers in the bronchial tubes that previously didn't move well due to constant exposure to smoke will start to move again. This is beneficial for the lungs. These fibers help move irritants and bacteria out of the lungs, helping reduce the risk for infection. 4 to 6 hours In around 4 to 6 hours, your breath becomes fresher. Even after a few hours without a cigarette, the nicotine levels in your body fall quickly, which can cause nicotine withdrawal. Around this time, you may start to experience symptoms and feelings such as irritability and restlessness. Make sure you remind yourself that your body is healthier without tobacco. 10 hours. Cigarettes contain a lot of known toxins including carbon monoxide, a gas present in cigarette smoke. This gas can be harmful or fatal in high doses and prevents oxygen from entering the lungs and blood. When inhaled in large doses in a short time, suffocation can occur from lack of oxygen. As 10 hours without a cigarette, the body cleanses itself of the excess carbon monoxide from the cigarette. The carbon monoxide level returns to normal, increasing the body's oxygen levels. One day. In as little as one day after quitting smoking, a person's blood pressure begins to drop, decreasing the risk of heart. In this short time, a person's oxygen levels will have risen, making physical activity and exercise easier to do, promoting heart-healthy habits. 4 Days By the end of day 4, you breathe easier and have more energy. Also the nicotine levels in a person's body are depleted. Most people will experience moodiness and irritability, severe headaches, and cravings as the body readjusts. 1 Week the one-week milestone is important not only for your health, but for your success rate in quitting smoking successfully long-term. Smokers who successfully make it one week without smoking are nine times as likely to successfully quit. The chances of quitting smoking for good increase with every attempt. If you can make it to one week, you can make it for a lifetime. One month. In as little as one month, a person's lung function begins to improve, as the lungs heal and lung capacity improves. Because fibers in the lungs that help keep the lungs healthy are growing back. These fibers can help reduce excess mucus buildup and protect against bacterial infection. Athletic endurance increases. 3 months. At the 3 month point, plenty is happening in your body. Your immune system will also be starting to recover, enabling your body to do a better job of fighting off infection. Your circulation system will be working better and your blood will be less thick and sticky, so the blood flow to your feet and hands will have improved. 6 Months After 6 months of quitting, many people often notice they're better able to handle stressful events that come their way without feeling like they need to smoke. They may also notice they're coughing up much less mucus and phlegm. This is because the airways are much less inflamed without the constant exposure to cigarette smoke and the chemicals contained within cigarette. 1 Year after one year as a non-smoker, your increased risk of coronary heart disease will be half that of a person who continues to smoke. Your lungs will have experienced dramatic health improvements in terms of capacity and functioning. You'll notice how much easier you breathe when you're exerting yourself and how much less coughing you have compared to when you smoked. In addition to these health benefits, you'll have saved a dramatic amount of money. Smoking cigarettes is expensive. 5 Years After 5 years without smoking, the body has healed itself enough for the artery and blood vessels to begin to widen again. This widening means the blood is less likely to clot, lowering the risk of stroke. And compared to when you first quit, you're half as likely to get cancer of the mouth, throat or esophagus. Here are some tips to help you quit smoking succeed. 1. Find your reason. To get motivated, you need a powerful, personal reason to quit. It may be to look and feel younger or lower your chance of getting lung cancer, heart disease, or other conditions. Choose a reason that is strong enough to outweigh the urge to light up. 2. Set a quit date. Pick a day that you'll stop smoking. Put it on your calendar and write that you'll quit on that day. Throw away your cigarettes, all of your cigarettes. 
3. Expect some physical symptoms. If your body is addicted to nicotine, you may go through withdrawal when you quit. Physical feelings of withdrawal can include headaches or stomach aches, crabbiness, jumpiness, or depression, lack of energy, dry mouth, a desire to eat. 4. Lean on your loved ones. Tell your friends, family, and other people you're close to that you're trying to quit. They can encourage you to keep going, especially when you're tempted to light up. 5. Get moving. Being active can curb nicotine cravings and ease some symptoms. Even mild exercise helps, such as walking your dog or cleaning your room. 6. Eat fruits and veggies. Don't try to diet while you give up cigarettes. Too much deprivation can easily backfire. Instead, keep things simple and try to eat more fruits and vegetables. These are good for your whole body. 7. Reward yourself. Quitting smoking isn't easy. Give yourself a well-deserved reward. Set aside the money you usually spend on cigarettes and buy something like a gift card, movie, or some clothes. Celebrate again every smoke-free year. You earned it. Guys, please write me in the comments. Do you smoke or not? Maybe you quit it. Share with me. It will be interesting. And if you liked this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. See you in my new videos. And be healthy.